it is time once again for another latchkey food review and today is the second to the last day of the month tomorrow will be the last day so I plan on uh, doing a few chicken sandwich reviews today and then tomorrow do a review of the month overall uh, on chicken sandwiches which ones I thought were the best uh, you know all of that good information that you might need to know in the future uh, as far as uh, getting yourself a chicken sandwich per my recommendation <laughs> all right so today I think the first one I'm going to try out is going to be oh let's try what Arby's has to offer all right folks so we are pulling into the Arby's now and uh, we're gonna see what they got in the ways of a chicken sandwich there we go Arby's good looking little restaurant in this town one of the newer restaurants I think in this town is this Arby so all right all right what kind of, ooh. they got several chicken sandwich options here Let's see what we got two for Hello, seven thank you for choosing Arby's would you like to try a Wagyu Steakhouse burger meal you can order when you're ready yeah let me get two of your classic Chicken sandwiches. Two classic chicken sandwiches? Yeah. Anything else? I'll be Alright, thank you. Alright, so look, I could not <laughs> resist that deal. Seven dollars and seventy cent at Arby's for two classic chicken sandwiches. Are you kidding me? That's a deal, folks, right there. That is a deal. So I give like six sixty. All right, there you go. Okay, thank you. Like I was about to say, yesterday, oh. Hello, Moto. Sorry about that. Too many interruptions. Phone number I don't recognize. Like I was saying, yesterday I paid uh, $6.60 at for the uh, Kentucky Fried Chicken chicken sandwich. Arby's is giving me two of them for $7.70. Two for seven is the deal. I guess uh, the 70 cent is taxes uh, from this town. But anyway, <laughs> I see some I see some good looking stuff here at Arby's. And I got a buffalo chicken sandwich here too. I think what it is is the same one. They just dip it dip the whole thing in buffalo sauce uh, we might have to give that one a try before these two days are done as well I mean I don't know if we'll get around to all of them or not but you know I think we've got you know some of the best ones already covered uh, throughout this month I mean you know there'll be another chicken sandwich month I'm sure uh, next year <laughs> And, and you know I'll be eating some you know throughout the year as we go along but anyway I'm gonna cut it right here and we're gonna wait on them to cook my fresh chicken sandwiches and they're gonna bring them to me and hand them to me right there at that door all right so I finally got them it, it took them a minute I mean it is like uh, chef startup here 
because it is uh, 16 after 11, so I don't think they've been open very long. We're gonna pull over and uh, give one of these a try real quick. Look at there, folks. Two of them. For $7.70, man, I can't believe that. Now, that <laughs> is how Burger King should be selling their chicken sandwich. And uh, I'm going to show you this. That is their chicken sandwich. Got a little lettuce and tomato on there. A little mayo. Really thin sliced tomatoes. I like that. Thin sliced. Now, that's a pretty good amount of chicken in there. That's a pretty good amount, for sure. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, I think their version is more of a it's good it's juicy it is juicy chicken's not dry at all but I think it's more of a you know come frozen they throw in the fryer that situation to warm it up and give to me to have <laughs> it, it gets a little thin on the end kind of like Burger King's I'll show you right here yeah the meat starts to get a little thin toward the, on the edges just like Burger King's Royal Crispy Chicken Sandwich but hey two for seven dollars Burger King, I pay five dollars and sixty cent for one of these. So, I am definitely digging this deal, and I don't have anything to drink, folks. I drank all my water, and I wasn't prepared. <laughs> and I don't want to buy one of their diet sodas here. Because then my seven dollar meal would be close to nine, ten dollars. <laughs> because the drinks are expensive; they're outrageous these days. That's good value. That's a really good chicken sandwich, too. I'm eating both of them. I can tell you that right now. That is good. Now, is it the best? No. No, it's not. This will definitely not be on my, on my top 10 list. But it is good. It is delicious. All right. So I'm going to drive away. And uh, I'll do like I always do. And I will give you my final thoughts. All right. So the Arby's Classic Chicken Sandwich. Uh, I got nothing bad to say about it. It is what it is. It is... Uh, a very good and decent chicken sandwich. Uh, 
very tasty. The the chicken inside of it is uh, really good. I mean, it, it's got a good taste to it. I mean, uh, you can tell it's not hand breaded and uh, made like some of these other specialty sandwiches are. Uh, but for what it is and the value that I got it for is amazing. I don't know if it's always going to be that two for seven like that, but I've, I've seen it on their sign there for a pretty long time. Uh, and, uh, you know, you know I, I, I had to give it a review. <laughs> it is Chicken Sandwich Month, and it deserves its place in the review. I said a while ago that it didn't have a place in the top ten. It kind of does. I guess it kind of kind of kind of does uh, I definitely have to I definitely have to for the value give it a two thumbs up uh, but at the same time it wouldn't be my uh, highest recommendation uh, on the totem pole of, of chicken sandwiches that I've tried out so far but I but I would go get it again for the value of it all and uh, yeah, it tastes pretty good, and for the value, you can't beat it. Can't beat that. All right, folks, that is all I have to say for the Arby's Classic uh, classic Chicken Sandwich. All right, so y'all know what to do. Till the next one, y'all have a good one.